Hey there guys, this is Flamzeron, aka YouTube's Toski, and yeah, another Saint Seiya game. Uh, it was recently announced, I think, as part of a tie-in with Soul of Gold, because that started up as well. A new Saint Seiya game called Saint Seiya Soldier Soul. Um, it's coming out for PS3, PS4, and PC. And the trailer showed a little bit of footage. We know that the Fabulous Five being, you know, Seiya, Shiryu, Shun, Hyoga, and Iki are going to be in it. And based on Masakazu Morita's voice clip, we imagine it's going to be that cast, the uh, quote-unquote video game slash Hades cast, which I think is kind of carrying over in Soul of Gold anyway. And uh, we also know that Ioli is going to be in it, but he also gets his new cloth, his god cloth. Uh from Soul of Gold. Do we even really know it's a god if it's a god cloth? Have they really even explained that? Because I kind of... I don't know. It's basically a new cloth for him. And you look at the footage, it almost kind of looks like a DLC for Brave Soldiers. I'm not entirely sure if that's the case. Because I feel like in terms of DLC, it's kind of too late. So it might just... And because of that, you know, some people might be thinking, oh, it's just a repackaged Brave Soldiers with Soul of Gold stuff. But I don't know if that's entirely true either. I mean, it's really just one trailer, and obviously this is going to be a successor or sequel to Brave Soldiers, but I don't know if it's going to be the exact same game. Like, it'll probably, they'll probably use some recycled stuff as most fighting game sequels do, of anime games at least. They tend to, anime games in general tend to recycle stuff. I, I feel like that's, their market's a little different than what most would expect. But I'm looking forward to it, and I hope they uh, iron out some of the th things that I thought was uh, wrong with uh, Brave Soldiers. I was looking back at my review, and I saw that I never did, like, the dash. Like, just the regular, like, forward, forward dash. I don't even remember if I mentioned it in that. <laughs> but I'm definitely going to get this game probably on PS4. I imagine there's a chance it might come out in North America since Brave Soldiers came out, and it seemed to have done okay. It didn't get too many good reviews, but it seemed to have sold a decent amount. And I'm I'm looking forward to it. The footage, I couldn't really tell if it was PS4 footage. It, it looked like PS3 footage, so I imagine they're just trying to, like, iron things out. I, I imagine once the, uh, once, like, Tokyo Game Show or whatever comes out, it'll, uh, they'll, is it actually going to be coming out in the fall? And there's a news article a while ago about Namco of Europe licensing something called Soldier Soul, so I guess this is what it was for. So they must have been working on this for a while. And so, I feel like since we kind of have a bit of a date, a time frame on this game, because, you know, this was announced, like, pretty early on, I think. I'd have to go back and look at the news article. But I'm really glad that we're getting another Saint Seiya game, because I feel like after watching Rini Kakuro, I feel like I've gotten more interested in Saint Seiya. And I'm glad that we're that we're uh, getting, and I know that the Hades OVAs are on Netflix in North America with the English and Spanish subs if you want that, so that's cool. And it seems like Saint Seiya is finally getting some traction and getting more popular, and hopefully this game, if it comes out in North America, will do more. I hope they include, like, some characters from Omega, though, and maybe even someone from Next Dimension. Even if they include, like, the version of Tenma from Lost Canvas, and just on the grounds of him not being a complete carbon copy of Seiya. Because he looks a lot like Seiya in Next Dimension. And maybe more, uh, maybe the, I forget the guy's name, uh, the uh, angel guy who's trying to kill Seiya. But it, it, at any rate, it'd be a, it'll be interesting to see what all they add in this game. I mean, they have more material to work with this time. And who knows, maybe what we saw was just was just like a teaser to show how different the game will be. I don't know. I know some people may be skeptical, and you can call me being a little too naive and optimistic if you want, but I'd, I th I'd rather just see it for myself before I make any judgment. And again, even if it is like just a lot of recycled stuff, I don't think that'll bother me too much. But I am glad that we're getting another Saint Seiya game. I remember I kept telling myself, like, if they're going to make a new Saint Seiya game, I'm going to get it on PS4. But, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm looking forward to this. And 
like I said, I just hope they just add more characters and work out some of the issues I had with uh, Brave Soldiers. And maybe some uh, more original music would be nice too, I suppose. But uh, yeah, that's all I've got for Soldier's Soul right now. I'll keep you guys updated as stuff comes out. But yeah, this is Flames Around AKA YouTube Sasuke signing out. Burn your cosmo strong and ascend to the seventh... Or awaken your seventh sense. I, I kind of ruined it. Yeah, bye.